Okay, so um, basically today we're doing another SCP episode. So I know that you guys, uh, I think you guys like these videos. I honestly don't know because no one comments on my videos. So today we're going to be uh, going through demonstrations of SCPs and see how, and we're going to basically rate the games. So the SCPs we're doing is SCP-173. SCP-096, and SCP-939. Um, these were just the demonstrations that I found, so like, I'm gonna do SCP-173 demonstration first. So, um, I don't know how good this game is. Um, I just found these, and basically I'm just going to be reading them. There's something wrong with one of my keys on my keyboard. Oh my god. Well, um, so basically we're going to be looking for SCP-173. Seems like it's over there, and it just killed someone. Well, I can't seem to find it right now. This game is pretty laggy, and other people seem to be taking recognition of that. Well, I don't know if that was correct wording, I'm just saying that. And, um... I'm gonna be going over, um the SCPs when we get to the articles after we are done doing the SCP done with the SCPs I think it might be in here actually let me in oh yeah oh I was looking at it well um okay it won't let me respawn so basically I give this game a five I mean, no, not a 5, um, uh, 8 out of 10, it could have done better with, like, looking at, the looking at it thing, but, um, I honestly think the building was good, and everything else was good, and now we're gonna be doing SCP-096, Classic Maze, I've never heard of S an S SCP-096 Maze, but, um, I guess that there is. Oh, all my keys on my keyboard is broken. I don't know what's up with that. Oh, SCP-096 is over here. Wait, I need to get my battle gear. I'm ready. Okay, so, um... Gonna... Do oh no, it's going into rage mode. Got her on. On what? Oh, it's starting to run. Oh frick, oh frick, oh frick, oh frick.
they'll never find me. And they found me. That's great. This building. Um. So I'm going to give this game a 5 out of 10. The building could have been better. Like, way better. Um. And I'll tell you why when we get to the articles. But now we're going to be doing this one. I'm going to turn up the volume for this one. And you'll understand when I get to the article. This building is- oh, jeez. I'm gonna retry that, cause that wasn't... that. I don't think that that works. Okay, so, um, I'm giving that game a, like, 7 out of 10. The building was great, but, like, it didn't work as I expected it to. Um, and you'll see why. Um, so, um, basically, um, I, this thing, well, it won't let me turn off the screen recorder for some reason. Uh... Okay, so now we're going to be going over the paragraphs that explain the SCPs. So, SCP-173, Class Euclid. Um, so basically, uh, its origin is yet unknown. So, we're going to get down to the good stuff. Um, and I cannot find the good stuff. Um, so basically, no fewer than three... 3D class, which is basically, um, uh, light, like, prisoners that have gone for life sentences and were sent to the SCP Foundation may enter at a time, and the door m must be locked behind them. At all times, two, per two people m must maintain direct eye contact with SCP-173 until all personnel have back aided and relock the container. And if you're wondering um why they like clean up the containers because all this like crap on the ground can make another one of these and then it makes it harder to clean it up. And then they can escape again and then um and basically um at, they can um end the world basically but um for some reason it's a Euclid. Um, so that is SCP-173, now SCP-096. I'm sure you all know this one, um, it's supposed to be contained in a airtight steel cube at all times. Weekly checks for any cracks or holes are mandatory. I don't know why this one's a Euclid, too. I honestly do not know. N you can't, like, record it or take pictures of it. Um, and you'll see why. Um, it's a humanoid creature with a, um, and it has, like, these gross arms. And it's just really gross. It has no body hair. And the jaw can open four times the normal, the norm of an average human. Um, and basically, I can't find it, but if you look at S SCP-096's face, then uh, it will uh, go to a, a point of, like, emotional distress, and then it'll, like, start crying and babbling, and then it'll enter a mode of rage, and will enter a state of rage, and then um, basically uh, just... Like, attack and kill, then eat whoever looked at its face. It's, like, um, I don't know. But, um, basically, that's what it does.
it's really creepy. And SCP-939. The reason I turned up the volume when I played that game was because this SCP makes humanoid uh, sounds, but in that SCP game, it sounded like it was making frog sounds, so like, uh, that's why I gave it the rating that it got. So basically, it's a keter, which is it can cause a doomsday-like event, and um, it's really deadly. That's all you have to say about that one, but um, thanks so much for watching.